fucking tired. The unclog. Okay. Over there in the corner. I'm not even gonna act like, oh, I just got home from work, just coming in, just saying hey. I'm literally like borderline tears right now because I had a different intro planned and then I walk into this and so I'm a little forgetful. Um, <laughs> how chaotic of an entrance. <laughs> I came home to this, so I'm a little uh, shaken up. He's literally only gone for a week, but he's my best friend. And I'm literally overseas. I'm literally on an island. <laughs> so like, I'm technically not being a baby about this because he could be gone for 12 hours and I would still probably cry. I'm gonna go take a, a little minty bee. I'll be right back. Okay, I'm back. Hey guys, what's up? Welcome to our channel. My name is Maddie. My husband Gabe is in the Air Force. We are stationed in Okinawa, Japan on Kadena, and I'm living alone. The drama. Um, just kidding. My husband is on TDY this week, and so I'm gonna show you what it's like being the one that doesn't get to leave. <laughs> I feel like this part of the military is something that it's the worst, honestly. Doesn't matter if it's 24 hours, 24 days, 24 months. It's all just crappy and so we've been through quite a few tdy's deployments military trials this is just a glimpse into how boring my life is without you girl <laughs> like i said earlier he's truly my best friend and so being overseas it's really hard to be the one that stays and doesn't get to go on the tdy <laughs> i'm the one that had to come home after work and it's like why in here we have no pets and no kids of course i have friends and i'm so grateful for them but like my friends don't live with me, you know? I just got home from work, came home to the cutest freaking surprise. I'm so happy that I came home to that, but I'm also excited because we have been going through dishwasher problems the past few months and Gerald texted me today that maintenance finally showed up and got us a new dishwasher. Out? Are you joking? Thank you, Jesus. This is a thank you, Jesus moment. Look at this. Oh my gosh. Stunning. This is gorge. You should have seen the last one. It's awful. No, yeah, this is perfect. I didn't work out this morning because we were wanting to cuddle up a little extra before you left. So I'm gonna change and then we're gonna do a workout. Change. Ready to go on a run. Usually Gabriel and I would go on runs before work, sometimes after work if we want to sleep in that day. But the main reason I'm going on a long run today is I need to go to the USO gate, which is where Gabriel parked his car for the driver to pick him up this morning. And so I want to bring his car back here. So I need to run over to the USO for sure. And then we'll come back here and do some weights. All right, let's go. We're trying out the on clouds for running. I wear them to work, but I'm debating on whether or not I want to get another pair for like working and running. I've been wearing hokas, but my hokas I arranged to the ground. So these are my new work shoes. I'm going to test them out on the screen. We'll see if they're worth the hype. Okay, does it make sense when I say it feels like I'm walking on bubbles? I don't know if I like them. I don't know. Okay, we made it. We got two miles. I'm drenched. We drive the car back. Do some weights. Not the fire trucks here. What is going on? Okay, final consensus on the hokas. I don't know if I like them. I loved the hokas for running, but I didn't like how clunky they looked. And they kind of felt clunky too. And I, I have my right size and everything. So I don't know if I maybe give them another shot or another few shots. I literally like threw away my hokas because they were they had holes in them. I had to go buy some of the on clouds. And I just like the look of a white shoe with all my scrubs too. So that's why I went with white. And then I like the, the look of a white shoe whenever I'm wearing like my workout outfits. That's why I want to get 
new running slash pickleball shoe because we've been playing pickleball a lot and I need something with like grip. If you guys have any running shoe recommendations or even pickleball shoe recommendations, let me know. We got a pair of actual tennis shoes for Gabriel. They look really good and like he plays in them very well. Like he's got like grip on the, the courts and everything. Play some your Rex. Place. Okay, so you guys remember like two seconds ago whenever I showed you that the fire trucks were here? My neighbor is texting me and she's like, yeah, we had an evacuation. I'm like, what? Why? Oh my gosh. I swear they'll just do like random smoke detector tests or something. But let me, I'm going to ask her if the evac was like or something. Well, I guess not because... I'm here. And I guess everybody was inside by the time that I got back. Whatever. Well, since it's just me, dinner, well, meals in general this week will be pretty light. I am going to bake some chicken and then make some salads. Usually what I do whenever doing my normal meals is I'll make enough dinner for us to have leftovers. But I'm not making a dinner every night this week. So I'm just gonna make like a bunch of chicken and a bunch of salads. Costco recently opened this past weekend. If you saw that video, go check it out. And I got some um, bulk lettuce, tomatoes, chicken, different things of that nature so that that way I'm like healthy snacking. So I'm just gonna hang out in my car. Oh my gosh, not these people taking out their hamster. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, the baby's got earmuffs on. Oh my gosh. That one was bad. I guess we'll just wait and see if they come back. You guys, I wish I was making this stuff up. It is 30 minutes later and the fire truck is finally arriving. Can you see it? Finally. That's a beautiful sight to see, ladies and gents. It's time to go inside. Oh my gosh, I just ran up the stairs. I'm gonna get this show on the road and get back to cooking. Ali, that's so annoying. Okay, let me show you what I got going on here. We got organic pasta. We got some tomatoes, green beans I'm about to put in the oven. Some fresh mozzarella, some basil. That's, I'm not using that anymore. We got salad. I'm about to chop this up, throw some panko on it, throw some ranch seasoning on it make like a baked ranch chicken. Yeah, so we'll have salads, we got a sandwich, chicken, veggies. Okay. I just took a shower. I can't make this up. This is the third time today. I was just about to eat. Okay, I simply cannot make this up either. Why did it just stop as I opened the door? I'm obviously not gonna leave now. I know it's a false alarm. <laughs> <laughs> I'm texting my neighbor. Oh my God. She said I was baking cookies, sis. Oh my God. My fear right now is that it's gonna go off at night. Like whenever I'm in bed. I don't know why it's doing this. Okay, anyways, I just finished making dinner and this is probably gonna be the longest day that I record because he just left. So it's kind of like, I have no one to talk to. You guys are just hearing my word vomit. I'm gonna eat real quick and then shut down this end of the house and move to that end of the house. I didn't reach for the phone, got me free though. Did they make me something? Stay out. I'm gonna do my devotional book. I think I should be able to call me here soon. He's had a really long travel day, so I'm gonna call it a night. So good night, see you guys in the morning. Okay, good morning guys. I am headed off to work. I'm not gonna film every single thing every single day. Just showing you a little bit of the morning routine. It is pouring outside, so no workout for me this morning. Working out in the dark is already scary and then working out in the rain is a little scary. So working out in the dark in the rain is a little scary to me. 
So we're gonna push it to this evening. Hopefully it dies down. I'll see you guys later whenever something crazy happens. Yeah. Bye. Oh my gosh, you guys, what a day. What a day, what a day, what a day. <sighs> okay, let me just catch you up real quick. We're high up, off the ground. We, we don't live on ground level. Therefore, we don't, we don't get bugs. We don't get things in our house. I've only ever seen one spider and one roach. Roaches are big here. Of course, this morning when I go to the bathroom, there's a little baby roach. And I know it's on a snake, but I'm like, if there's a baby, there's a mama. But I, I had no time. This morning, I, I've literally got full body chills. This morning, I had to kill, be gone. I had to go to work. <gasps> then I get home, I take off my clothes, I put them in the dirty hamper. I, when I open up the dirty hamper, something just, bloop. oh my gosh, I literally have full body chills, you guys. Okay, the door shut behind me, but it's just because it's the wind. <laughs> I'm out of breath. I'm trying to kill this thing and I can't. I can't get it. It's crawling down. I can't, okay? So I, I'm shimmying my thing over. Let me give you like a little action. So it's it's in the laundry room and I, I get it out with my foot, the, the basket itself, because I'm like, the whole thing's got to go. I got to throw it all away, even the clothes in it. And I'm kicking it. I kick it all the way to the balcony door over there because we never got on that balcony. And I just kick it over sideways and by the grace of god the roach went out and our basket's not just a basket it's a basket and then it has a mesh material in the middle so like whenever you kick it over whenever you like push it over it'll like flop for some reason it stayed open and the roach flew out so then i'm like okay well i guess i'll keep the clothes i guess i'll keep the basket and i'm just letting it sit there because i need to mentally like calm down from this now i just get a notice because they're doing construction on the side of our freaking other balcony over there, not this one, the other one. <laughs> and they're like, you need to go put this tape over here. You need to clear all of the stuff off over there. And and I'm I'm kind of tweaking right now. I don't know. I don't think I can. Because then I have to lift up the whole grill that we have over there. We have the smoker on this one. We have the grill on the other one. I have to clear the grill out and then go put this tape over there. But I don't want to touch that balcony because that's just where the freaking mother is. <laughs> I'm texting Brianna right now. I'm like, I said, I am just a girl. I can't do this alone. And then I was able to do it alone. So I said, false alarm. She's like, you have to just call me next time. I'm like, I know, I know. Okay, let's go try and do this. Of course it's raining. This is a boy job. This is not a girl job. Oh my gosh, there he is over there in the corner. Okay, that way the door can stay open. Why is this so hard for me? Okay, so I need to take this tape off and I need to put it on the door over there. Fire door. Oh, perfect. Gabriel can come and do this. I'm gonna, okay, so it says I have to do this by next week, which I'll do it right now. And then it says to remove everything by next Thursday, but he'll be back. Woo! You see him? That's... Mr. Nasty. <sighs> I need to finish packing and I need to do some editing. I got stuff to do. I can't. I can't. Okay, winding down for the night. It's Bachelor at night, but Gearwell and I are not gonna miss an episode, so we just did FaceTime and Ron share play, and we're gonna end the night with some Bachelorette. Catch you guys when something else crazy happens. Another dollar, folks. I did not work out this morning because Gabriel and I stayed up late watching The Bachelorette last night and I was trying to listen to my body. I needed more sleep. So let's go do a workout. Also, my neighbor is the best. She's amazing. She made pumpkin snickerdoodles with homemade icing. Okay, change out of the nasty scrubs into a cute workout set. <sighs> Easy enough. Let's go for a run. We're gonna give the on cloud another shot. See how they do. Uh, I'm tired. The iPods still don't like them. It's a no go. 
is like 16, but one of my favorite ways to get my protein shake down the hatch because your and I are lactose intolerant so like we can have dairy it's just it's not preferred so we don't usually have it with milk or anything like that my friend Chloe taught me or told me about how she mixes her protein with orange juice and if that's not one of those genius hacks I don't know what is I quite literally will do orange juice vanilla protein and it is a cream sickle you guys okay let's go shower the rat's nest a little bit better. I'm wearing my PJs up at her house because like be really best friends if you don't show up to dinner in PJs. Claw clip it is. Okay. Time to go get some dinner and just get some social interaction. I'll see you when I get back. I'm back. That was so much fun. These are the times where it's like, you really gotta create a village. You do, and you can't do it alone most of the time. And if you can, props to you. But I feel like deep down inside, we're not supposed to be alone. And so times like this make me really thankful that I have people in my life here that care about me. Like that's, that's huge. There have definitely been times where he's gone on work trips where I haven't had friends yet or I hadn't known anyone and those are really hard <laughs> so it's a lot easier whenever you have people that you can go to and talk to and I'm just really thankful because now I have more desserts that I came home with <laughs> they were so sweet and kind I'm gonna FaceTime my hubby and talk to him about his day now that he's back and settled and I will catch you guys in the morning. Oh my gosh. Good morning. I'm gonna change it to a workout set. Throw this hair off. The humidity is making your guys fog up, so I put you on the couch just so you can see that I am doing a workout right now. You guys, I'm sorry, this is probably really annoying that the vlog is always in the kitchen. What can I say? I'm a working woman. That's always in the kitchen. It's rough out here. Let's make a protein shake. On the days that I do work out at my morning trio, my water, my protein shake, and my electrolytes. And then my other morning trio, seed, women's multi, and vitamin D. A breakfast that I've been eating on repeat is Dave's Killer Bread, banana, and peanut butter. Then you drizzle some honey, cinnamon, and uh, we're taking this tug up. Not gonna be taking the camera to work, but I will be taking my phone. I'll let you guys see my day today. Let's go to work. stuff from Crate and Barrel, but this is the last part of my order. 
and it's two little goals. I've got all my fall decor up. The sooner that happens, the sooner we can put up Christmas. The sooner we put up Christmas, the sooner it's over, and then we get to leave. Oh my gosh, these are adorable. Oh my gosh, stop it. I am dying. Oh my gosh, stop it. I need to clean up and we need to get prepped because tomorrow we head to Maryland to see my hubby. I can't wait, I'm so excited. I have showered and changed into my PJs. I literally, hold on, sorry, the washer is probably really loud. I literally only want Skims pajamas like for the rest of my life and that's such like an expensive habit but I literally have spoiled myself with a few pairs now and this material is literally unmatched. Next time they're having a sale, because sometimes, you know, you don't want to buy things full price. So it's a little more reasonable whenever you get it on a sale. We've got a candle going. I'm about to get my background show on. And since Gabriel's not here, I can like sprawl out all my stuff on the living room couch. Usually I do it in the bedroom, but I kind of want to bring it out to the couch. So then that way, like it's all this way and nothing's back there. I basically packed everything because him and I were packing together because we have to kind of plan for the climb. And if his bag didn't fit everything, I put it in my bag, stuff like that. So I just need to like finalize everything and do like toiletries because I literally am going from here, I'll go to work. I'm coming to drop my car off. I'm not even running upstairs. And Chloe's gonna take me to the airport. Busy, busy. Okay, I'm pretty much packed. I'm a little overweight, but what's new? I just really don't want to check a bag because I want to like get in there and go. So um, I've already got my boarding pass, so I should be able to just walk through security. Literally, I am two pounds over. So it's like, if they make me check it, whatever. I get a free check bag, but like I said, I'm trying to get there like, not as late as possible, but I hate sitting in the airport for no reason. So get there, chill. And then as soon as I land, like I'm going to see my husband. I don't want to sit around and wait for a bag. That's that. I think it's dinner time. Now I'm going to do some editing. It is bedtime. Laundry has a few more minutes for winding down last sleep before i see my man i'm gonna hit the hay talk to you when i wake up good night good morning i'm gonna get ready for the day and let's go okay 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 i straightened my hair this morning because I'm trying to look cute tonight. Today's breakfast is just gonna be a whole hearty banana. And I should probably throw the other one away. Oh, I need to take out the trash. Okay, there's a lot we gotta do. I will talk to you guys later. I'm headed off to work. Hey guys, what's up? I just got home from work. I have my bag packed, ready to go. Chloe's waiting for me downstairs. Let's go get Gabriel. <laughs> 